Hey, can I call you back? Thanks, the Retailvenator. Hi, it's Dr. Weiner, the Retailvenator. I want to talk to you about a PRP study I just read. It came out of the Baylor Orthopedic Department because they use a lot of PRP there. PRP is platelet-rich plasma. And what they showed is that aspirin might affect your PRP results. So what they did is they took 14 normal volunteers and they drew their blood, got the PRP out of it, and they measured the growth factors. Then they put the same patients on a baby aspirin, 81 milligrams per day, and they drew the PRP again and measured the growth factors. They showed it was significantly decreased in those patients. So what they found is aspirin irreversibly blocks the release of these growth factors from the platelets. And they suggested that it even can happen with ibuprofen or naproxen and all the other NSAID medications. They even suggested that perhaps you can activate the platelets with thrombin or other medications, but they still said the levels of the growth factors were markedly decreased in these aspirin patients. So make sure you take a good history and make sure the patients that are on aspirin have stopped it for at least 10 days so you get the best results from your PRP injections.